Ratcliffe swings and bloops it towards right field. Glazer coming over, dives, and the ball hits the ground. Ratcliffe around first. He's headed for second, and he'll stop there. Glazer misplayed that big time. And runs. Left-handed hitter, first pitch to him, swings, grounds it to the right side. Diving, stopped by height, and he'll hold on to it as he will not make a throw. 1-1 one, one from West. Swing and a high pop towards right. Servants navigating the wind, kind of drifted to the right side and let the ball has some sneaky speed. I don't know about it. The 1-0 line drive, center field, base hit. Michael Pyatt strokes one into center. That's the third hit of the rubber. Here's the 1-0. Swing and a chopper, West snares it, will jog it halfway to first, the underhand flip in time to get Blake Butler, and that will. He does trail one to nothing. 0-1, standing grounds it towards short, backhanded stop by Roland, throw it first, high throw, over first base, and stopping will be standing. E6, allowing standing to reach, and the Cougars have their set. Delivers the pitch, Pyatt takes it, off the glove of Welke, rolls towards the Cougars and script behind home plate. And stopping at second base with 86 in Warren Nolan. The 1 2 swung on, chopped up the middle. West gloves it well. We'll jog it halfway to first. The underhand flip with the left hand. Burying the Cougar pin. Nobody throwing, though. The 1 0 pitch swung on, hit in the air center field. Appling going back on it. Let's the wind push it back towards him as he'll make the catch for out number two. Let us know you're listening. Here's the 1 1. Pyatt swings, ropes one to right center field. This ball is going to drop and go all the way towards the corner. Pyatt's around first, headed for second. He'll be waved towards third base. The ball comes into the cutoff man, and Pyatt is in with a stand-up two-RBI triple all the way to that deep. Pitch from West. Fastball, called a strike on the inside corner, moves the count now to one and two. One ball, two strike count with two outs in the top of the first inning. Barker relays the sign out to his lefty west. And now the kick in the one-two. Swing and it's smoked foul up the line at third. Keeps the count even at a ball and two strikes. West, of course, his last outing, not his best. When an inning and a third, giving up two hits, three runs, walked four. The command is always the issue for West. If he has the command, he's very sharp. Here's the one-two pitch, swing and a miss. He strikes out the side in the first. The shoulders, the two-one. Swing and a chopper to third, standing will play it. Toss to second for one, the relay to first base. It is in time. Double play and the Cougars win. Here comes the one-two. Swing and a drive, left field. It's gonna send Pyatt back to the track, to the wall, and he makes the catch. All right, in front of the eye. And now the one-one. Line drive, right center field, base hit. Grayson will stop at second base. So Monty gets a stretch, the 3-1. But Dallas swings, grounds it up the middle, base hit. This game's tied. Mounty's rounding third. He's coming to the plate. Here comes Phillips' throw. Nope, he throws it into the cutoff man. It's a two-RBI, two-out single by Josh Dallas. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Barker puts a bunt down, third base side. It will roll fair. Picking it up is Henry. Throw to first, not in time. An infield drag bunt single by Caleb Barker. Blake Butler was daring. Seven average. This is 12th appearance in a game. Shows bunt, puts it back down. West picks it up with a bare hand. Spins, throws to first and in time to get Reed for out number one. Knots down there standing around with a jacket on. The 2-0 swung on, hit to short. Rackliffe plays it on a couple of hops. Throw across the diamond in time for the out. Three up, three down. West Hands to get the belt. There goes Appling, Cervantes takes the throw out to second base and it's almost into center field. Appling is safe. Height was late getting to the back. Hands looks 2-2, there goes Ratcliffe. Grayson swings and punches it into left field for a base hit. Appling will score, Ratcliffe's around second. He will go to third, stop there. And after a long, great at bat. Big lead, now the one-two. Swing and a line drive, center field, base hit. Grayson will score, Monty's rounding third. He's heading to the plate. Here comes the throw, gets by the cutoff man. Monty's in standing up. A two RBI single by Caleb Parker, and the Cougars at the shoulders. The two-one. Swing and a chopper to third. Standing will play it. Toss to second for one. The relay to first base. It is in time. Double play and the Cougars win. Great weekend, you know, to come out and sweep College of Charleston. I think that's the best team we've played all year. And, uh, you know, they, uh, they're they very offensive. They're very physical. They pitch well throughout. Starting pitching was good. Their relievers were pretty good. So, you know, we uh, we played well. You know, we, we, had to, we knew we had to play well coming in. Um, if we were going to win the series and to, and to sweep, it was big. You know, I thought Jared West today was outstanding. You know, 11 punch outs. He hadn't had great stuff the last couple of weeks. So it was really encouraging going to the conference play to see him bounce back and have a great, you know, great outing today. Thoughts on the upcoming midweek? 
Well, you know, Rice is going to be a big game. To, I mean, it's a, obviously an in-town in rival, and, uh, and it's, going to be a, it's going to be a packed house out here. Um, I have a great feeling that we're going to have a ton of fans out here to watch us play. Um, but also it's a chance for us to get a win against a great RPI team. You know, it's, that's a win that can really help us. And, you know, when we're trying to build your resume to go into the tournament in the year, that's, that's going to be a big one.